I'm David McDonald, and I'm a member of the band Paper Lions. I've always been a person who taps. I always, you know, I was really annoying to be, you know, I was a really annoying student because I would constantly be tapping during class, and it's just, and I, there's always music going in my head. But growing up, music was really the only thing that I was really passionate about. And it wasn't until grade 12 I was applying for all these different arts programs and finally I just realized the only thing that made sense for me was going and studying music. I have kind of an entrepreneurial spirit as well and in today's music business you really have to have some of that. Um, if for nothing else, uh, being good at selecting who you're working with from the business side of things because you can love music all you want. But, and I could be the best musician in the world just sitting here, but if no one knows about it, and if no one knows about the music, um, no one's gonna come out and see you. And, and then there's this whole making money side that can be really complicated. But there's also lots of other sides to the music business too. I mean, some people may not be as natural musicians, but they love listening to music, and rather than selling uh, cars, you'd be better at selling shows. So maybe you'd make a better booking agent. Lately, I've been working with Music PEI as education officer. Music PEI, David speaking. It's a natural fit for me because I studied music education in university. I'm qualified to teach music in schools. So when I'm home, I'm normally sitting in an office or uh, out in schools, uh, you know, talking to people about, about uh, jobs in the music business. And I've uh, made ice cream, I've fished oysters, I've done a lot of substitute teaching in schools. Um, there are, have been times when uh, with the band alone I've been able to you know, just live off that and when you're home in those situations that can be really nice because you don't have to work another job. But there have been times when uh, it's been necessary to do other things. This is the path that I took to become a musician. I, I studied music in university and I was invited to join a band that was not exactly in the genre of music that I was focusing on uh, in university. And then uh, that band started to grow and, uh, and I really enjoyed working with the band. And we started touring. The work culture of a member of Paper Lions is, is uh, traveling. You get up in the morning, uh, you drive anywhere from two to, could be, we often drive 40 hours straight. Um, it's not unusual for us. Um, you uh, arrive at a show sort of tired, and then you do a sound check, and then you get your second wind, you do the show, um, you sleep, or you drive overnight to the next place. Yeah, a day in the life of a member of Paper Lions is uh, traveling, eating, playing. Traveling, eating, playing, sleeping sometimes. You have to be able to deal with the situation of you going up there and most nights there being all these people cheering for you and you can't, you, you have to remain humble because uh, they're not always going to be there. <laughs> you, you know, you're going to come home and if you still think that people ought to treat you like you are being treated on stage everywhere you go, uh, you're in for a lot of disappointment. And, and you may disappoint some people around you too. Um, so uh, yeah, keep your head on straight. What if I could be